Hi there again, it's Ken here from Ken's Christmas Village again. Um, a follow-up from when I uh, talked about to converting all of my village's Christmas market stalls to mains operated. And I said to you what I had done was replace and put sockets into the back of the battery containers. And I've sat here this afternoon having a whale of a time fitting sockets to all of my village stalls so that they all work off mains uh, power off the Limax adapters. <clears throat> but some of you, when you come to try it, will find that some of these sneaky little stalls have the sockets in the, the battery cases in the bottom and not in the back. Now this means that if you fit one of these jacks, the stall won't fit smooth on the ground. So I scratched my head and thought, how can I come up with another way of doing that? And what I've done is very simple. I've taken the battery containers out again. And what I've done, uh, I bought myself a roll of fine cable. Um, I can fish this out and show you. Very fine, very fine. The finest uh, gauge cable I could buy um, online at Amazon. And what I've done is gone inside, taken the plastic um, battery cable out and connected some of this cable to the green and black wires that I told you about earlier on. I've then fed them out through the battery container. You can see maybe clearer on this one. I fed it out through the bottom of the battery container and I cut a groove. These stalls are made out of resin and I used, um, I've got some modelers files. These little tiny modelers files and what I did was I cut a groove, filed a groove in the base so that I could feed the cable out the back so that they will sit nice and smooth. And then on the other end, I have fitted one of these little joyous things, which is a 2.1 millimeter socket, um, which will take the, uh, it's the female version. So the jack from the Limax power supplier plugs into this. And there we have, this stall is now illuminated. If I pull this out, you will see that that's the plug that I've used. So this um, is very simple. It's another way you can, what you can do, and I've done this before with things is you bury this cable at the back underneath snow um, and underneath your, however you put your village together. And again, you can now connect these up to mains and that now operates this one that has got the cable coming out of the base at the bottom. So if any of you think, well, what am I going to do with the ones that have got the battery container on the bottom? This is a very simple way of doing it. Feeding the cable out that you can then bury and connect to the socket on the other end. So before you start shouting at me, which some of you are bound to do, say that doesn't work on the ones that have got the battery container in the bottom. I discovered that myself and uh, figured out a solution. And I spent many, um, probably a couple of happy hours this afternoon uh, doing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, market stalls that I've now converted all of them to work on mains and solve those challenges along the way. Um, I didn't solder. Some of you may say, well, try and solder wires to the battery containers. I tried that, it was really tricky. I couldn't get the solder to stick. I spent hours trying to do it and it was easier just to take the container out and reattach new cables um, to the uh, cables that were coming off the LED that was in the market store. So anyway, if you have any questions at all, please, again, just message me. I'm always happy to help, as are many other uh, lovely uh, members in these groups that we all subscribe to. So happy villaging uh, and enjoy yourselves again, as I said, on the run up to Christmas and see you all again soon. Take care. Bye for now.